Hi guy, today I thought I'd show you a Squaresoft game, so a Squaresoft US game called Secret of Evermore. It was a US only title, uh, I believe it was their first attempt to try to break the uh, US market with RPGs. Now I think I read recently, I think it was Games TM article, that uh, they didn't succeed, it, it, it didn't, didn't sell, but it's a fairly decent game so I thought I'd uh, have a quick walkthrough. Quite late in the SNES life, uh, 95. As you can see, I've already started, but uh, start a new game so you can see it from the beginning. I hope it'll let me call this one a loft as well. There we go, it has. Yeah, it's uh, it's hard to describe without ruining the story. It involves time travel uh, and an intriguing crossover between our world and uh, a mixture of some peculiar fantasy ones, and quite a lot of reference to some really old B movies and uh, a lot of scripted jokes for it as well. Smith's Hardware. I think one of the reasons for this failing at the time, and I'm only, again, I'm only going off the old bits I've read over the years, uh, I think they've just released uh, one of the Final Fantasy games and they were expecting something really special from... Uh, oh, actually it might have been Secret of Mana, I'm not sure, anyway. They're expecting something really special over there, and and when they were hit with this, were hit with this, I don't think a lot of people quite understood thinking behind it. Oh, there you go, something's not gone right. Thirty years later. Ah yes, the dog. We'll see in a second just uh, how interesting this game can be. I mean, it beats the like of uh, Fallout 3 and Fable 2 for having a, 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 a canine companion that you can interact with, as I'm sure you'll soon see. Dogs chase the cat away, and now the guys chase the dog away. I like how kids is doing some fish he shouldn't. See, there you go. I don't know what that means, that reference, but it was a, again another release to an old, uh, old B American B movie. We should get out of here before something goes terribly wrong. And there goes the mutt. I'll meet you shortly after. That's it, Grant, send us home.
Oh, I just, I just pressed start there by accident and it skipped the story. But I suppose it's taken us straight into the game. As you can see, I can move around just like uh, any top down action game. Pressing the B, yellow button, uses his weapon. Y and green brings up a menu. Use usual uh, RPG stuff. Not standard bone bill looks of it. Let's have a look. And doing X or blue does exactly the same, I think. Oh no, they're all different menus. Right. Go kill something. Found a petal. Right, this is where it's interesting. I think I'm too early on in the game to say, but you say you've got your dog here. Besides helping out with attacks and joining in the fight, he uh, he can. Oh my God, he's scratching himself. He can be quite useful and will hunt down stuff. Uh, can be of use. Wander over here and another plant down. Yeah, you know, so we've not got time to show you in the video, plus, I'm not too far ahead of where we're playing from on my save file. But the uh, what's that? It's a leaf. I have a strange feeling about this. Oh. Got an item here. Another menu. Action. Oh yeah, yeah. I didn't know. I actually didn't realise you could do this. You can uh, change your dog's fighting style. I could really do with. Uh, Sweat to heal. Come on, doggy, or else I'm going to die. Yeah, sorry, guys. What I was going to say before about the game is it's uh, based. Across lots of different different B movie type worlds, like this is like a Jurassic Park type, and I think you've got like your alien alien landings, uh, your moon landings. Oh, dogs dragging me away, and off to safety. Yeah, I'm okay, old man. Oh, they were raptors. Yeah, strangely enough, he changed. No, no thanks, we won't save. And it seems I can steal stuff, sorry, take stuff for free from the village. Weapon skill, tag in, window edits, control. Oh well, made something different. Well, oh, I'm sorry guys, but uh, time's ticking away. I'll uh, do my best and have uh, another video po posted soon, but thanks for watching.